So let me, let me ask you something. Ask me something. Don't you think beer's boring lately? I, I could use for something to spice up the beer life, sure. Well, I've put a little project together in my spare time that I think is going to whet your whistle for booze. All right, then. Imagine a woman of your dreams, your object of desire. You said this is beer? Her sensuality, yeah. Her passion. Her butt. Her taste. Huh? Feel her smell. Smell her butt. Her voice. Now free your fantasies and imagine that with a magic wand you can close it in one box. See what I mean? The golden drink no. brewed with her lure and grace and flavored with instinct. Wait, what are you talking about? A woman's essence in beer. Discovered a process of oh, it's like a marketing thing. Of her femininity. Okay. Instincts by isolation of lactic Don't my infographic style animations sell you on this? Lactic acid bacteria from her vagina? That's right. Additionally, we examine the final bacteria in terms of its purity. What? Like, we really get our noses in there. Production of sour ales, lambics, Flanders ales, and sour... I don't know enough about beer, I guess, because I didn't think this was a thing. It's yoni bacteria, slow beef, okay? Oh. Selected beautiful Czech model, Alexandra Well... To be our source of the yoni. So I'm drinking beer made... She's the first woman, as far as I know. ...stay with you after the meeting for the following week long. So, you take bacteria from her vagina and make yeah. beer out of it. This insanity... You got it. Overwhelm your mind. Thirsty? Why did you think of that? We have devoted much time... Because I wanted something good in my beer for once. So I thought, what better than pussy? ...possesses all the desired instincts... Am I wrong? Are you trying to pitch me that there is a long vetting process for this? Well, yeah, we don't just, like, you know, have a woman stick her vagina in a bottle and then sell it. Are you sure... ...filtering process. Were you vetting the women, or were a lot of them turning you down with this idea, though? Is that... I spent most of my time in the lab. <laughs> That's why it's called. We did our homework, as you can see. We have prepared many perks. Oh, all of these have been dipped in vaginas. I see. The shirt, the tie, everything. Based on their girlfriend's yoni bacteria. You can make you can make beer out of my girlfriend's bacteria. <laughs> It will enable wow. us to brew six batches of approximately 16... That's a, that's a very specific amount of beer. We are going to wring out a lot of vaginas for this. ...future products, including the beers we have described in our Indiegogo offer. We encourage... I am kind of stunned here. And I think they are going to. You know, yeah, I... I can think of no reason that they would be appalled by this. part in our crowdfunding action. So... I think I see your pitch, okay? Guys like- Yeah, my pitch is, imagine the essence of a woman in one bottle of beer. That means beer with a flavor of champagne. Wait, no, 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 hold on, wait, what do you mean beer with a flavor of champagne, though? Because beer- I mean, let me just sum it up for you in five words. Uh-huh. Hashtag beer. Hashtag vagina. <laughs> Hashtag erotic. Hashtag brewery. Hashtag Yanni. I mean, that's I, I certainly can't argue with those trends. I think I've answered your questions. All you have to do, slow beef, uh -huh. you dull beer, samey, natty light drinker you, mm. use your imagination. My first base beer that I usually drink? Is that what you're getting? Imagine a woman of your dreams, your object of desire, her charm, her sensuality, her passion, Try her taste. Feel her smell. Ha have your senses multitask. You know? Try her taste. Hear her voice. That's like some- this is like something a serial killer would say. Imagine her massaging you passionately and whispering into your ear everything you want. Now free your fantasies and imagine with a magic wand- I don't know why a magic wand, but just go to the other Yeah, no, Close yeah. Close it in one bottle of beer. Uh... Uh, the like when you're, I want you to be jacking off when you're drinking beer, slow beef. I'm sorry, I'm so confused. I want you still. to be cranking it when you're getting buzzed. I didn't think this was even possible. Beer in, other stuff out, right? Am I right? Yeah. 
It's the golden drink brewed with her lure, grace, and flavored with instincts. When I think of a golden drink or liquid coming from the vagina, this beer is not my first thought here. I'm just going to tell you. What, what's your first thought? I don't understand. I mean, I can think of other things that maybe could hurt your marketing a little, but... Well, I can think of some things that will help the marketing, such as imagining the beer of which every sip is a rendezvous with this hot woman of your dreams. She... Uh huh. How much would you give for that beer, Slow Beef? You mean after she hugged me and kissed me gently, looking straight into my eyes? Absolutely. Uh, how much are you asking for that beer? Well, let me show you this picture and you tell me. Uh huh. This is femininity in its purest form. Ooh, um, she looks like she's dead. Well, it is exhausting getting your vagina essence into these into these bottles of beer. Oh, she's just passed out and from Yeah, it's just kind of tired. Femininity in its purest form, huh? Yeah. Absolutely. Uh, uh I it, it's like the beer is a detective like examining a crime scene here with its partner the Yanni symbol. The order of Yanni, which is what we're called. Oh, it's the order of the, the Vietnamese word for vagina, huh? It's Sanskrit, yes, absolutely. Sanskrit, thank you. technology making creation of such unique beer possible. The beer containing a quintessence. <sighs> the possibility of, con of conversion of a tasty beer into a date with a real goddess? Into a date with real goddess. But, but a date, okay. Are you hard as fuck? Um, looking the at- The secret of the beer lies in her vagina! Look at the next picture. You got, uh, you got underwear on the beer, I get it. Subtle. It's a dark brew, too, for vagina beer. That's like a Guinness or something. Well, you have options. You don't have to drink the beer straight from the bottle. You know, you could dip it in panties and let it soak on your head for a while. How could I not? Um, yeah. <laughs> oh God, what, tell me more about your pitch. As I said, the secret of the beer lies in her vagina. I noticed that's a hyperlink, by the way, the vagina, but okay. I wouldn't click that. Using high tech of microbiology, we isolate, examine, and prepare lactic acid bacteria from vagina of an unique woman. Also a hyperlink, I see. Mm-hmm. Transfers a woman's features, allure, grace, glamour, her instincts into beers and other products, turning them into a dance with lovely angel. I really feel like I can't tell if you're mixing metaphors or you actually think beer is like a date with a goddess or a dance with an angel. Mm -hmm. And as you can see, we not only use vaginal bacteria for the beer, but we also dip uh, women's hair into the beer as well. Oh, I see that. Yeah, it might. you might have even capped the bottle with her hair caught in it. Her hair is actually stuck. Uh, it was oh. bottled prematurely, so gotcha. she is unfortunately trapped like that forever. She, she. But the good news is, she comes with a beer, huh? This looks like she was between frames, like of the camera, like you snapped right after she was done smiling or something, you know? Like post shot. Now I know, I know the first thing you're thinking, Slow Beef, is uh -huh. is this v vagina beer safe? Well, let me tell you. No. The crucial part of this project is to ensure the safety of the product. Why is that a hyperlink, too? Don't click that either. The procedures of isolation and preparation prevent other bacteria and viruses from surviving, providing the final product clean and healthy. What? We also examine it, make sure there's no other viruses and bacteria present, because that would be kind of gross. Are you telling me so that you swab the vagina, put the bacteria under a microscope, and filter out? Any of the mm. non Yanni? That's right. Mm. If we can isolate human DNA, then we can isolate the Yoni bacteria. I believe you. Um, Please. Uh, okay, I get it. You wanna you wanna know about the perks? Do I? You wanna know what you're getting for your inevitable donation? All right. You can just give me two euros, uh -huh. and I'll put your name on the website Wall of Fame. Whoa. It is the easiest way to bring the great dream of vaginal beers to the reality. The the great dream of the vaginal beers. The yeah. shared dream that if only I had that magic lamp, I would... Mm -hmm. Wow. Well, uh... All right. Maybe a wall isn't good enough for you. Maybe you got a few more euros. Well, how about a postcard for seven? Uh-huh. You'll get a postcard with the Yanni logo and the model home delivery. The <laughs> model will be on the postcard. The model herself doesn't actually... 
I would hope it, come to I would hope the postcard would be home delivery. Like I don't have to go pick it up or something. And in case you think that's kind of weird, well, hey, maybe the postman will think you have good taste. What? Why would the maybe the postman will think you are crazy? But surely he will know you are a nice man. Why is the postman reading my mail and making judgment on me based on it? Like, oh, a nice guy the, with the vagina beer. It's a Euro thing. Uh, Nine Euros, VIP Wall of Fame. Uh, your photo <laughs> will be on there alongside with your names to exist. You will be immortalized I wait. as an investor in vagina beer for all of eternity. Uh, all right. Um, You'll open the website, find yourself there, show it to your daughter, son, or grandchild, and you'll say, look, my <laughs> beloved child. I am one of the founding fathers and fo and founding mothers of this wonderful world of vaginal products. <laughs> I okay, I see. <laughs> so let me get your daughter in here. <laughs> I don't know about that. I don't know about all that. I think I don't think you're not ready to say that. <laughs> Let's hold off on that. What else you got? All right. Well, if you give me six more euros, give me fifteen. I'll tag you in a post on Facebook. So your friends, your family will see you contributes to the great idea. I feel like you're scaling back in prizes somewhat, and I still don't know about this. Don't you want the world to know? Ah. Of your fine tastes in booze? <laughs> it's the founding... Fathers and founding mothers of this wonderful world of vaginal products, huh? You do have to say exactly that if you give nine euros. <laughs> Look, my beloved child. Mm -hmm. uh, 19 euros, you get a voucher for a beer. Yeah, I see. And then it looks like past that, there's a lot of vouchers for like beers and things like that. Beers, posters, beer pads. I noticed for odds and ends. For 34 euros, I get an empty bottle. Thank, thanks for that. Well, the smell of the vagina right. is forever. Yeah, no, I, I I, gathered. It's like when you fart in a jar and close it. Yeah. Um, Only if this is good. Are there any other good perks or that I should know? Well, there's a few things here and there. We got branded glasses. We got Yoni Polo shirts and ties. We have iPhone Samsung wooden cases for some reason. Yeah, what is that? We have a Yoni belt. A vagina belt? No, it's just a regular belt. Oh, okay. All right. Say. You get a poster, too. Oh, hey, you know. Of a vagina? Yeah. Oh, okay. All right. An autographed. Oh, hey, cool. All right. Written by the vagina. Sure. No, I understand. You get more beers. You get a golden black lighter, more vouchers. A, I mean, we're getting kind of high here. 2,020 yeah. euros. Wow, I get a pallet of beer? Or, yeah. or, I'm sorry, a voucher for... A, where do I redeem this voucher? Like, I just drive up to a bar with a forklift? Like, yeah, I have a pallet of beer, vagina beer coming to me, pal. Once the uh, once the Indiegogo campaign ends, then you click on the vagina link, and that's where you get it. Oh, I see. Got it. Yeah. Um, A big Euro pallet voucher for a bit over 5,000 euros, and then uh -huh. here is the piece de resistance. Mm-hmm. 10,000 euros, you get a voucher for 60 bottles of the beer, produced on your girlfriend's vaginal bacteria. According to the title of your perk, that's my girl fiend's bacteria. Well, perhaps you are living with a demon. Okay. Just... From an other world. <laughs> sure. Got it. Sorry. Just... You can be your girl fiend or girlfriend. It doesn't matter. Okay. This beer knows no dimensional boundaries. I see. 40 grams of the bacteria to produce homemade kefir. Uh -huh. Additionally, uh, just FYI, may require a visit to a gynecologist, specifically in Poland or Germany. I'm assuming that's on top of the 10,000 euros I'm already paying. <laughs> yeah. So I need... You gotta want it. I need um, 10,000 euros and an open-minded girlfriend whom I'd like to drink the essence of. I hear you're married, slow beef. I, this feels kind of like... It's like somebody who wants to be an alcoholic uh, vampire in a way. You know, like, I really want to drink pussy. blood, but I can't get away from booze. Mm -hmm. Maybe that's what I'm... Oh, man. This is so... This, this is an idea. I will give you that. I 
Now I do want to show you a picture of how we bottle these beers. If you scroll down a bit, uh, where it says "Vision of the Future Next Products," I see. I, yeah, I think that just gives you. This is a look into our lab uh, laboratory. Bottled instinct, huh? Is just a beginning. Oh my god. Whoa. Uh, there's now, more. Now, I'm pretty forward thinking, and I'm already thinking ahead to what our next beers are going to be like. Oh. Uh, I mean, vagina beer, I mean, it's pretty great, but what about BDSM ale? I'm sorry, what? Sour ale made from smoked plums and vaginal lactic acid bacteria of redhead or brunette model. Why do redheads or brunettes like BDSM now? Why is that a thing? What about blonde ale made with wheat malt, saffron, and edible gold? with vaginal lactic acid bacteria of a blonde-haired model or celebrity. Now, wh Any celebrity. Any celebrity would be willing to do this. Uh, why? Wait, but why is there a beer specifically for blondes, and then the other hair type is just BDSM? Blondes aren't into BDSM. Oh, is that a thing? Sorry. Okay. Mm -hmm. I wasn't aware. What about Aphrodisia or Dionysia? Uh, wheat ale made from ancient strains of wheat grape juice. So now I'm definitely drinking a goddess. Yeah. Okay. Before it was a date, but now I'm drinking the goddess. Okay. Or maybe you're not ready for a goddess. What about the Mona Lisa? What? Brown sour ale with wooden chips. The wooden... tribute to the famous piece of art. Wooden chips? Is that a beer thing? Would you Would you like to drink Isis beer? Wait, I'm sorry, what? Isis <laughs> beer. Let's, let's maybe think about rebranding that one. No, what are you talking about? The god Isis. No, yeah. God Isis. Yeah. I know, and also the thing from Archer, but there's other things in the modern world named Isis. I'm just throwing it out there. Well, none that you would equate to sour ancient wheat ale with roses. I guess you got me on that. Wait, wait, did we? I think we were getting away from vagina. Cleopatra. Milk stout regarding to Cleopatra's milk baths. <laughs> I feel like now this is just becoming regular beer that you're just mentioning has a thing to do with women. And uh, uh, Lady Godiva, sour ale with English hops. I don't, I don't know. Yeah, all right. I, I'm sure. Wait, many, many of other great beers based on anime, history, <laughs> modern culture, etc. How the fuck other... did you just shove anime in there? <laughs> Why not? History, modern culture, and anime, really? We're doing this? I mean, you didn't have my money before, but now. You'll be one punch drunk, Slow Beef. <laughs> uh. And apparently you've got other Yanni products, drinks, libido drinks, keffers, and yogurts coming up, huh? We count on you. I bet you do. I bet you do. Um. Here's the pussy! <laughs> Sold. I'm just looking through your gallery, and it's <laughs> thank you. You're, no, you're you're quite welcome. Mm. Anime. Ah, uh, I'm gonna have to get back to you on this one. That's fair. All right.